Wow, what is going on? <laughs> Looks almost like ice cream. Oh, that's wonderful. Mm. I kind of want to control. I don't think I do. No. Are you sure? Well, you're done. Oh, <laughs> come on. <laughs> How do you have that in your sleeve? We've done a few cheese videos with you, Henry. You have. I love it every time. Yeah. <laughs> this time, we have come to a place which specializes in gorgonzola. I do love a little bit of gorgonzola. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> <laughs> wow, okay, first cheeses are out. So we got three different age parmesan, starting from the 24 months aged, our 36 months aged, and last but not least, we have 72 months aged parmesan. Enjoy. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. It's like when you talk to a mother and they're like, how old's the baby? And it's like 18 months. Yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now this is very special, Emery. I don't know, you must have seen when we went to Italy that we had our I own saw. jolly wheel of parmigiano. Easy. I did give dad some of that yeah. parmesan. Yeah. I brought some yeah. back. Yeah. Really Really enjoyed it actually. Yeah, yeah. First up, it's like two year aged cheese. Feels like we're in McDonald's. A little bit uncouth, <laughs> <but> okay, <laughs> chicken nuggets. Yeah, that's <laughs> definitely not what this is. Mm. Guys took big bites. Mm. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, it's strong. Mm. Oh, it's good it cheese. That's really Salt nice. crystals in there. Mm. I'm used to Parmesan, like if you have it by itself, being a bit much. Or it's kind of like things. essence of vomity. No, like, okay. Flavor. Yeah, that is what you said. I forgot. You know. It, <laughs> no, no. <laughs> do you do? Um, I know what you mean. Yeah. But unfortunately, it's it's so delicious. Yeah. You you don't is. associate deliciousness with vomit. No. Until now. No. <laughs> <laughs> the dipping sauce is sort of honey. Cheese and honey, that's a thing they do like fairly often in Italy. Works so well. Mm. Wow. Gosh, that's really good. The savoury and the sweet. Oh my gosh, that's incredible. Yeah. Mm. Okay. I'd take that over chicken nuggets any day. <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, any day. Imagine that in a happy meal. <laughs> that is not a fair competition. <laughs> We're now moving on to a parmesan with seven year prison sentence. Okay. <laughs> six, six years. Six, six. Yeah. Yeah, it got out a year early for good behavior. <laughs> okay, good behavior. Oh gosh. Is this balsamico? Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, this of course good. can be quite sweet as well. The cheese isn't overwhelmed by the balsamic, is it? Wow, okay. Round two is where we take our name from, is our gorgonzola. This oh, is our hey. signature. It looks almost like ice cream, doesn't it? It does, mm. yeah. Oh. It's basically a fancy dairy Lee Dunker, isn't it? Well, <laughs> what? We just because we've got a cracker with it. It is, it is. <laughs> This is like an elite cheese lover's yeah. dairy yeah. dunker. Wow, look at that. I don't know if I've ever seen gorgonzola that looks this creamy. I've glued things together with stuff like this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Hopefully it doesn't taste like glue. <laughs> oh, baby. Oh, that's wonderful. Wow. Oh, wow. You know, the contrast between the Gosh. smooth cheese and the yeah. crispy biscuit, the texture difference really is really great. Right. Just like a Dairy Lee Duncan. No, you know? okay. like, that's no. no. <laughs> Dairy Lee Duncan's are, are very, very popular mm -hmm. around the world. They're beloved by children everywhere. I mean, maybe we should compare. I kind of want a Dairy Lee Duncan as a control. I don't think I do. What, you're, yeah, no. No. Are you sure? What, you're oh, yeah. come on. How do you have that in your sleeve? <laughs> what? <laughs> How? How did you know? I mean, come on, it does look quite similar, does it not? Uh, no, that's not even cheese. Uh, I think we need to be careful what we say for, okay, for legal well, reasons. <laughs> <laughs> so as a control, I will try okay. this. Okay. okay, I've got literally maybe the best gorgonzola I've ever tasted in my entire life in my hand, and you're handing me a Dairy Lee Dunker. <laughs> Dairy Lee Dunkers are, as I said, they're a best-selling product around the world. And Italians all over the world right now are livid. <laughs> okay, here, I'll dip, it, dip away. Come on, this, is, this feels blasphemous. Well, the first thing is, it doesn't actually taste of cheese. <laughs> Gosh, that's so disgusting. <laughs> Zero cheese. You the cracker doesn't taste of a cracker and the cheese no. doesn't taste of cheese. You know what it is? That cracker, it tastes, is like herb and spice with like artificial Pringles flavoring. That's what, it tastes like a Pringle. That's why I like it. It's not as good as a Pringle. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it, it tastes like when you dip a Pringles into like a cheap supermarket dip, there's a time and a place for that. I'll tell you where the time and place oh, probably man. isn't. You is right now in yeah. London's like most elite cheese bar. What about this? Oh, oh no, 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 don't ruin the gorgonzola. Does it work? 
That's pretty good. It's basically like dipping a Pringle into a really good gorgonzola. I do want to try it. I do want to try it. I don't think I do. No, okay. The creamy bits are, um, so are more good. creamy than cream. Pretty good. That's incredible. That is, that's elite. The dairy. That is really good. You should try that, Henry. That's Seriously. really, oh, okay. really good. I mean, the cheese is Seriously. so good. It's really good. It doesn't matter. It's actually it doesn't matter what you eat it with. It's just really good. But also, good. The, the dusting of the Pringles flavouring. Doesn't hurt. It doesn't, doesn't hurt. hurt. Doesn't hurt. <laughs> it doesn't. <laughs> I feel like an idiot saying you know, it. It's like a peasant marrying a prince. I think I'll go for the princess, actually. Okay. <laughs> Thank you to today's sponsor, HelloFresh. Now, Josh, I don't know whether you can remember, but we had a little cook-off in this very kitchen with a HelloFresh recipe. We did. I'm trying to remember who won. Okay. Well, uh, no matter who won, their recipes were very, very easy to make, and yet you still managed to win that competition. I remember you saying, Josh, that the hardest part of cooking is the grocery shopping. It is. If you sympathize with Josh, HelloFresh have got you covered. They take all of the time and hassle out of grocery shopping. All you have to do is choose your recipe for the week, your portion size, and then schedule in the delivery. They also offer a wide variety of recipes every week, including calorie smart options, vegetarian options, and family friendly options. Without sponsors like HelloFresh, we wouldn't be able to make content like this. So if you want to go check them out, click the link in the description and use code JOLLYFRESH to get an incredible deal. You'll get 60% off the first box and 20% off the next two months if you're in the UK. And if you're not, there are other deals wherever you are in the world. All right. Let's eat some more cheese. Guys, the main event has just arrived. Wow. Should we start with this? Uh... Spicy. Spicy gorgonzola. Spicy, Spicy gorgonzola. gorgonzola. Yes, guys. Mm. Oh, wow. Okay, it's some um, mm. slow burn. Mmm, yeah. Oh, at first it's so subtle. Just smooth. And then it just comes mm. through the flavor. It's the texture of butter. Kind it of is. Room yeah. temperature butter. It is, yeah. It's incredible because it's got a lot of flavor. Like you can feel that in your nose, mm -hmm. but the taste is not at all. It's not excessively strong. That's what I like about gorgonzola is it's got this, it's got some of the smell, but actually mm. it tastes very creamy and mild. Mm. You know, it, it doesn't. You don't get that kind of re revulsion that you mm -hmm. can get in these like really strong cheeses. Cheers, guys. Right. Cheers, Cheers. For that. Yeah. <laughs> Mm. Should we have some duck ham? Duck, duck ham. ham. Which is weird. It sounds like beef bacon. Maybe it's going to be incredible. Oh, oh. yeah. Oh, yeah. That's definitely, dark. definitely dark. Mm -hmm. Actually, really nice. Wow, I don't know what to think about. I've never had tasted anything like that. Well, it, it really tastes like a kind of cured meat you can have with like a really, bunch of cheese. It tastes like a fancy, like, Iberico ham or something. They know what they're doing here. But it's made from duck. Yeah. And it's got, like, a very distinct duck flavor. All right, more cheese. Come good. on. More gorgonzola. Oh, look at that. It looks like cream cheese. Yeah. It does. And, like, sticky. Oh, wow. Smell that. Oh, yeah. The truffle's really strong. Okay. Okay. Let's go. So when you first bite into it, what you taste is the truffle, mm -hmm. and then the cheese hits you after. That is very oh. truffly. Oh, really wow. truffly. Actually, wow. I really like that. I'm, it's, it's not good. You're not a fan. It's too much for you. It's just a bit much. You know, cool it a little mm -hmm. bit. No, I like the truffle. No, the truffle no. goes up my nose. Oh, good. I like the cracker. Yeah. Oh, just wants a cracker. I like the cracker. By itself. But no, honestly, wow. honestly, that to me, it's more intense than the spicy gorgonzola. It definitely is. It is. And it's it just, is. It, it's tipping it into a realm that I'm a little uncomfortable. Okay, yeah. Come on, Luke. Luke I want to Luke needs to try this. That right. is one of the- It's quite the... strong. That's a lot. That is a lot. Yeah, we are that much. That's one of the most like rich, intense cheese flavors I've ever had. Ooh. Yeah. I like gorgonzola with truffle. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Beef salami. Yeah. There we go. Wow. Mmm. Oh. Interestingly. Mm. Wow. It tastes like salami. You named it correctly, guys. <laughs> 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 yeah. Next up, black pig mortadella. Mm. I, I love a bit of mortadella. Oh, that's good. Holy that moly, takes that's me really good. Straight back to Italy. I wonder whether it's the black pig that that kind of yeah. makes the difference. You know, it must be Korean barbecue. You have got the same thing. Like the black pig from Jeju, mm -hmm. the best, the best pork. And in the music industry, black pink. I mean, I know they're separated by two letters. Okay. But they are also just real top. Top, top notch. Top notch. Okay. <laughs> You're an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Wow. What are you doing? What are you doing? 
I don't think that's, oh my gosh. Are you, are you allowed to do that? You just pierced it, <laughs> like, what is going on? <laughs> Why did you just twirl it around in there? I wanted to make sure I got, like it's a 99 flake in an ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look oh, at that, jeez. That's a thing of beauty. Mm-hmm. 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 Oh, uh, soothing. That is. That, that is, is soothing. stunning. It's like an afternoon sleep, isn't it? <laughs> a little afternoon nap. <laughs> yeah. If gorgonzola is a punch wow. to the taste buds, yeah. that's a kind of massage, isn't it? Mm. Oh, it's really a spa is. day. Mm. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's things like this that make me realise, what are vegans doing? <laughs> you know? Seriously. Isn't it amazing wow. that cheeses can vary so enormously? Mm. And it's all the same thing, really. Yeah. It's an incredible thing. And some people are just so intolerant of dairy. Yeah. Yeah, well, I mean, I mean not my choice. <laughs> oh, wow. What is this? So we go figs filled with gorgonzola. Wow. Wow. Thank you figs very much. Figs and gorgonzola. Thank you very much. It looks amazing. I mean, those are enormous figs as well. I feel a little bit like Julius Caesar, emperor of the Roman Empire. Eats whatever the heck he wants, yep. you know. Raging dictator. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Look at that. Figs for Gorgonzola. See, I never even heard of that as a thing. Mmm. Mmm. Oh yeah, all the Gorgonzola really comes through at the end, it right? It does. You almost don't taste the figs all that much. Well, the, the fig has got this beautiful, soft yeah. texture. It's really lovely. Mm. Yeah. This is the truffle one. This is the truffle one. Okay, this is the one that it was a bit much. It was quite strong, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Nice. That is yeah. a strong flavor. Yeah. All, all in. All in. Mmm. Mm. Wow. I prefer that so because I, the, the fig takes away wow. just some, of the, some of the intensity. Wow, well, yeah. Mm. Like, I've never I've never had cheese with figs before. I know, me neither. Mm. It works. That really it works. works. Why not? Guess what? The Italians know what they're doing when it comes to food. <laughs> surprise, surprise. <laughs> yeah. wow. wow. Well, this has been amazing. Absolutely really incredible. Like Fantastic. Brutus, we need to bring this to an end. Okay. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Hopefully not in the same way. <laughs> I feel like we should just find out the fanciest, coolest bars we can go to and just take Dad out to them. I'm game. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, well, as long as cheese is involved. All right, well, on that note. In the meantime, see you, see you Johnny, Johnny soon. soon. <laughs>